Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Formula One 2019, the episode 43, and it's time to go over to Spain. So if you've not watched the last episode, this was in more than one thing. If you've not watched this one, go back and watch that before you watch it. Uh, it went, it didn't go well as I wanted to, uh, I did, but I was in point, but I got penalty for uh, a season track limit. And obviously I ended up in 14, so um, the pace wasn't there, well, um, I'm hoping things will change when we go over to Spain. So we got power to department short out. So our facility on relative function was currently one thing we can consider is to improve the facility to include more international area and activity make it home away from home and tell his staff to spend more time here and make him feel more rewarded when they do a remodel to be expected but it is in the three improve that more now. Um yeah go for it. I don't want my staff to be happy to that's the only way to make things work. But then we knew I sponsored um we got two points of a million not enough to but another spec unfortunately. Uh, the shortest points not enough. Um, so I'm gonna short all of this out and then I'll see you when I've done it. Right, to it done it, um, we got aerial, we focused quite a lot of aerial stimulating training and rather promotion. So I'm not sure, um, so we got, I remember we had new specs too. So I'm hoping with this, um, uh, meet the store to come in, I'm hoping we have in now to go out from. Uh, to make that one respect to their need and respect. We got two up the coming in at for Spain and that the ability. Um, and I'm doubting we don't actually have anything else we can do. No, it's just the ability only what we can actually do. So let's hope we will get enough money to be able to buy more respect up there. I mean, that's what most for it. To our area. In the new heart model, so I need um, to do something to afford it. Um, what's the word for it? Um, use the bit out as much as I can. So we got 3.57, that's definitely not enough. No, we need 6.5. Um, I'm going to focus on. I need to know how my power train is in the uh, molar. My target to feel quite as I don't know the corner. It was quite quick, due to earlier, but power train, it didn't feel quick, so I don't know if there's an issue with power train, do I need to get that one respectfully as well. So that, that's why I need to finish in turn slash and point P8, if that's the target, and I don't remember how much exactly we're getting, 9.42 million. That's really due for it, um, so we should go and wait to see, then I'm going to go ahead and uh, to that turn to uh, practice in Spain and I'll see you in qualifying. Uh, we have just finished my practice section now I'm going to be heading over to qualifying. Now. So we had a good practice section and we did have a little mishap. We're going to show you that now. Okay, damage to the rear wing. You've got damage to your rear wing. Suggest we box to repair it. So with that, uh, Mr. Hart, which was um, that door, the tap the out of the wall where I continue practice practicing. Um, I didn't lose some time due to obviously the pairing, but you know what? I think this, the practice that went quite well. well and wasn't the worst thing in the world. Um, I'm hoping to actually improve it in qualifying. So, um, but I'm going to show you the production hit that I forgot to show you. So, we've got a uh, hat still the same all the way through. Um, the day they done a big jump right now. Um, I also, uh, just let you know, I've applied a new update into the game now. So, there's a new pattern patch, patch notation. So, there's a new pack note in. Um, and which is, I think might have helped my daily, I'm not sure that helped my daily now, but my daily to P1, and um, not P1, first place in performance chart, along with McBoy and then McLaren, for the Ali, so that's your big uh, four, really, that like actor Martin, who pretty much stays the same, 
they are pay only done up that certain little um, uh, line up where NXW had quite a lot of upload coming through which is true so it's not the William Davis name, Alpha Ox name, the Hat status is name, Alpha the Mayor's pretty much the same, and then Alpha Town is pretty much the same. So it's not a big change, the only big change was the Mercedes and Ferrari that had the big change for sure. So I'm going to over to Qualifying and I'm hoping to do really well and I'm actually hoping to finish um, in points, that's for sure. To make up for the mistakes I've done in the Mola, so I was there. I would love to finish in points. I mean, it's a dream if I'm if I can finish in a uh, podium. That's a big dream for me. Um, so we're gonna keep this that top, which is this um tire. So I want to that um um the toilet a Dutchman field a lot to um so we did a. We shoot off fuel and loan to 5 kilo and everything healthy. Yep, perfect. So, I'm gonna pop out and I'm gonna do my first run. So I should finish my qualifying and I'm P1 at the moment with professional pole but that's it in, I don't really think you call a professional pole uh, and that's in Tuesday but we stuck in uh, but what's that I mean I told you I feel much more interested now from what happened in Mauler we got to the speed of it and doing what I am with the mind it's uncomfortable in Mauler but it was far more employees but we took policy but the car wasn't that quite active so in Spain the actors have been really well so hopefully we get the result so we got a system I'm probably not going to do any more um but it'll be P2 um and they, they always time that everyone can actually take me out into uh two, two out for the um but one twelfth um I think one do not to dwell because I need to stay some tire um but I'm happy to dwell on this tire and then just finish the race with this um two but with that tire so I don't gonna dwell to my well, tactically third one to be honest I pulled out third one to the track limit as usual. So um two two is tactically third one so two two starting one is tactically third one but one just stay so I'm gonna dwell to my stat the one and I was still at the end. So I finish my the run to the improve the time um but you know it was only the hand off of jaw that pre does and we should fill it to one and we are going to be P four the three button in the row that's do um I mean I'm 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 just happy we finally do we do um with our oh, poor chair I think let's hope we can recover in one thing so now we're gonna go ahead and head over to two two. I'm um, just glad we're doing really about that now. Made to look for the mistake from uh, Miami and try the mistake in a Mola. So let's try we do really well uh, in two two. So we're gonna do the same thing. We um gonna do two long. I think two long works back to back. Two to two tire warmed up in the second one, and the fuel is even lower. So it's a two slot and choose to do that. Um, so I'm gonna go out now, do my first one, and I'll see you at the end of the step to one.
But as he finished my third boy, I started not to do that too much, and I was tired of why. As you obviously saw in the uh, highlight, my P1 professional pole at the moment, um, with 1 minute 10.4, that's even faster than last one, which I'm really happy about. So that's why I thought, you know what, let's save the tyre um, to the additional point of doing lean one and then damage all my components as well. So, we might well to take it easy, like, relax for a bit and um, to go down to the final minute, but about this to be good. So, we are 110, we're point 0.4, which is incredible. Um, it's basically over, I think, 10. Specific the section, the least best time is 1 minute 10, the point 0.4 is it. And I'm not sure if you state that the tenth uh, of, so I, uh, but that's still impressive at the time. So I think I'm gonna do well. I'm gonna do my first section one. So I'm doing my section one. I'm still at the end. Three minutes to go. Alright, so I should finish my factory one to the improve the time, unfortunately. But you know, it's fun, it's not uh, a bad deal. Uh, my slow I can stay in, twos, uh, in top 10, make it into two, three. So I'm going to speed up, and I don't know where my choice to be, and we are still there. Oh, fantastic, we're the fastest uh, driver at the moment. Oh, what about that? What about that? I thought it's, um, we don't. Both Mercedes in both Ferrari, Old Horn, then uh, Rook Max Verstappen, Dak, then Houghton, Burton, Lawton. So we got um, the three power box that Oxford, Mutie, and Lance Law are out in 2 2. So we're going to be heading over to 2 3. And let's hope we pull off our first ever pole position. So we got ourselves back on P1 and I'm just, I, I, I had the bit in data like two qualifying uh, and my speed slope of how tar the tar is just somehow shift the whole thing from Miami um uh, the molar base of you no know, the, the uncomfortable and other thing shift it into becoming me at the tar becoming at one you know they are incredible for it. It's a good day for our team, 100%. Uh, we are the fastest. Uh, we, 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 uh, pff, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know, but, but it's, we are somehow end up being on P1. If we're not in step to one, we end up having faster times than George. And then in step to two, when we, we did have a better time. Or step to two, we very close to it. So in step to one, it's our better time, which is good. The hour stay for that one. Um, so I'm, I think I'm going to go out now. Um, well, let's just go a bit more and then, then I'm going to go out now. i going to do my uh, final one. Yeah, to pull out the stretching one, uh, well, I feel like my stretching one, but it did not um, do really well. I end up getting into the level towards the end, as you see it. Well, at least we know we were 20, so, but oh, we're a lot better if I was on pole or stuck and play, no fun low locked out, but it's just fun low. <sighs> How about to the Bust, bust. The Duke Music, we know how quick I am in this tar. The tar is quick. 
so it's not a problem we are gonna go ahead and um the Rosie to drive to Spain long point on Sunday at being this David Palace. So I might see if we can improve the time for ourselves. Welcome along everyone to sunny Spain, specifically to the circuit de Barcelona, Catalonia. So many great moments in Formula One history have been written at this very track over the years, including Michael Schumacher's first win for Ferrari back in 96. That win was in the rain. We might have better weather here today, but we're just as overjoyed to be at the Spanish Grand Prix. It's an updated track at Catalonia, and the popular opinion in the paddock is that we never wanted the chicane in the first place. That's now been gone, the final corner is much faster, and at 2.9 miles and 14 turns, we await the Spanish Grand Prix. So with the race not far away from starting, here's what today's grid rundown looks like. What a qualifying yesterday for George Russell. He'll start today's race from pole position. And it's Charles Leclerc in P2. Moving on to the rest of the grid, we have Sainz, Norris, Hulkenberg, Verstappen, the owner driver, Ocon, Gasly, Liam Lawson, De Vries, Perez, Bottas, Oscar Piastri, Sonoda, Stroll, Albon, Theo Porcher, Sargent, Magnussen, Joe, and Jake Hughes. It's almost time for the lights to go out, so let's head down to the track where preparations are underway. And joining me again for the race today, Natalie Pinkham. Let's have a chat about Williams. What do you make of their performance so far this season? Well, the atmosphere within the team seems very positive at the moment. Everyone seems like they're in great spirits and having a lot of fun doing what they do. And that has definitely contributed to the performances we've seen. Uh, we don't know this here, we that turn to Spain, Rome, Spain. Um, as we know in the qualifying we had a really good run where uh, two one two T R P one and then two they P one then up the P W S T right now. Um, but of uh, no, it, I'm happy with where I'm where I'm right now because it's just an opportunity to be able to do something and obviously the the uh, expectations coming into the like is too high and finish P five. Uh, but all the time is fast, another thing, and obviously the minimum uh, expectation is better than points, which is P10, all above. I'm happy for it. So, obviously, getting the line up to the route, and I'm hoping to turn back on and have a really good start. And try and see if I can get my stuff to so know I love dark bombing on the outside or the inside when the opportunity to open. So we're just waiting to see what will happen. And we're just looking for five rounds in life now. And he's going to be underway with George Marshall on P1, the Tyler P2. And we've got Tyler like breathing down the net of George. And I'm doing the same to Matt Verstappen. And Matt Verstappen on the inside with Tyler. And I'm pulled over to the outside. And I'm going down the outside of overtaking two Tyler. A Tyler side in the Ferrari with Matt Verstappen in the ball. And now I shot myself up the P then tried to if I can overtake the George Russell. Um, but I didn't do it because it was too quick and he put himself on the two position for the defense. And we on board with a span out on um fighting with Nick the Free. Then Mr. Free got the inside line. Then he take the P well then he take P9 from my span out on or out on. You like the defense really well to try to take the position back. It looks like Nick the Free has taken the position for my span all the time and we got both my day they just done all the dominating right now and obviously I went off the track no more to new as I dive down the inside overtake and Matt Verstappen up to surely overtake really proud of it now it's an opportunity for me to try and pull away for Matt Verstappen and maybe try to attack uh, my day they missed it definitely very unlikely to do that and Charles has set the fastest time, 1 minute 13. Obviously that's not the fastest time, the fastest time is actually 1 minute 10. Uh, to, that to stay in the um, 12 hour, I set up 1 minute 10.4 with the impact of, and we on board with both the 12 and fighting to take a little total, take P8. 
and we do we make the fight with Hottenberg doing basically the dangerous shover and I believe it's Hottenberg now taking the PA from Nick the fight and he got uh, not really good uh, composure and got the overtake done and now I just think um, but the day is in lap 8 now as we done more this lap later um, George Lushaw is now taking 8 steps turn away from me which is you know, it's incredible. I mean, at this single lab, at least one step to niche, and we got Max Verstappen and Lando Norris, so we have for me right now. And obviously, I don't try and be calm, but it, we got a lot of pressure. But we got information from uh, NG and Mark today that Lando got an issue, which is a big one because Lando is my rival and he's behind me, and Max Verstappen is looking to make the move. On Lando Nolly on the inside and Lando Snow down team up and he held up quite a lot of the car behind him, including his teammate Tyler Sire. And we've got Lando going in to the pit and I'm not sure if we've got damage, but I still or this one we take no damage and also I'm looking at replay yeah, no damage. So I'm assuming there's an, an issue we got is running we fixed it for it or something. And we've got but of Lando held up, we got all six seven cars all tanks together and we've got Sturgeo making a move on Octopiastri who is it now in his third year in the Formula 1 but Octopiastri did ban really well on Dirty Pado and we've got another uh, Aston Martin with uh, Espan Alton dropped the move down onto Nick the Free and we've got Nick Hortenberg and P5 along with Tarlo, Gatley and Alton so obviously we got all the tar bunch up as you know to the Nando's issue and we now bought both Miss Lady. We for sure know they are going to be one of the most uh back and forth um waste driver the Steven and Darius Hina and we got the Tlar got the move on to George Russell Tatum P one. So it's a bit one for both of them, but I do believe it Little uh, finish and late, it should tie the point. I think it's your finish and late first, you beat in the head. And I don't need to pay in lap dicting into double team along with uh, Holtenberg, Sayed, Alton, Dathlin. They all don't need to pay to pit on to hard tyre. So obviously, for me, the, the tyre was getting really uncomfortable. So I put a hard tyre, try it out. We need to make sure there's no mistake, there's no mistake, fantastic. And I got myself out nice on P5. Um, and obviously that is the bit one because obviously if you finish uh, like they you are P1 and you pay uh, and they reach the top on P3 you are going to go back in P1 if you don't make a mistake so I was P3 and I already locked two places so that means I'm going to cover two more places but we got Max Verstappen um, in the pit so I'm going to overtake him now take P4 we got Lando 4 stuck in my head and we got Lando pretty early due to an um, issue we got I got Matt Tomer now and he's going to be, be behind Octopi Ashley and Hortenberg and then Daphne, I think Daphne behind him now. So we're now going to be chasing down onto Orlando Noddy. But it's going to be quite quick for us anyway. We know Orlando's still got issue even at Mark. You see, if he knows anything about Orlando, if he's still got issue, he does still have issue, which is a good news, but we can take P D back. And I do believe it won't matter if uh, he doesn't have an issue, he will have to pit anyway, I think, but he pit it quite early, like lap 8, and surely the hard time, like, all the way to the end, so I don't know, Dr. Dion, like, overtaking him on the outside, had a little contact, and I'm still committed to it, even at one of the track, I'm still committed, got the overtake done, um, really proud to myself on that one, and I'll take him the back. And we've got Lando's still slow and it's apparently an incident. Still don't know who, but we've got Lando doing the pit as it's still a mini map. Lando went into the pit. So I'm assuming something happened, and we've got the old Porsche up the track. So I'm assuming it was part of the uh, last lap, there was the other issue, um, an incident. So I'm assuming they talked about Theo, but he got me title to find it last lap. And we've got Stuart the Pella doing that for me right now. I bet I slowed down quite a lot due to obviously far to Lando. So Pallet is taking peace the and I'm wanting to try to dive down the inside, but Pallet done really well. Uh, petitioning himself, um, defending me. 
for me to move on to him to eat in lap 20, to eat in lap 23. I think probably everything and got them try to overtake Tyler clean without any, you no know, technician as I got by him quite a lap breeze by initially going to slip the easy overtake I've done and I got to move on him up to P3 which I'm really happy about and I do believe it's going to be a bit of fight between me and Sturtio will be taunting back and forth and I'm actually trying to break the slip stream in lap 24 and Pala to see now and Pala is going down on the, in, on the outside trying to overtake me but he couldn't get it done did I think I'm leading well and I'm not blame the law for that because we know how fast and what balls are and because of the taunt and fighting me and Pala we got Holtenberg leaping up now and I'm now trying to make sure Holtenberg doesn't pass me and we got the deal I'm trying to do the same move as I've done in lap 23 or 4 uh, but he positioned himself really well doing lap 28 it's not it's been taunting like I said and I'm trying and trying to overtake him try to pull away from him but at the same time I'm trying to pull off like a move like Carlos Sire sitting in real life in Singapore we try to do it with Holton Bird to make sure he can stay close so he can fight with Pala as I got the move on here is up to do stunning overtake on the inside so I'm hoping this is finally over with the Taunton fight with Pala so in that 30 this Pallet is still quite close, so he's going to be a proper fight for third play. So it's really very far for P3. The, it, 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 it probably one of my favourite race by far. The Tonchon fighting is really exciting. I've got Pallet trying to get on the outside, but because I uh, defend really well, getting the break and do quite clean and try to step myself up to act it. And I you know I've done that quite well. And because of the um, power in the board are in the little bit quick, not at quick in the day or with Ferrari, but they are still quicker than me. I was a power with the um, slip stream and the other, and I tried to sweep him under the bar, and he did make a little contact with me. But the two knew that I know how to defend, and I defend really well on power. And you know, obviously, he got the move and clean defend and keeping P3. So in lap 32, just before okay, last lap, we got um, an incident that we got Lando nodded out of station. Don't know what happened to Lando, I think he's something to do with the issue he got. And uh, in the last like, day, just before last lap, Horton Burr getting the move done on Sturzio, taking a P4. Didn't he do it? He's done it. They so take him P4. He didn't now going to be chasing that for me. And I do believe uh, Paula got a little dummy. But he contacted me in lap, in lap 32, but then he don't declare. Terminal P1 with George, Terminal P2. So now it's the way to the end for P3. Hortenberg and have the other. I don't. Hortenberg has potential to finish the race ahead of me if I don't mix it up. So I've been telling myself, keep calm. So mixed up. So I told to stay in that back, and back over and over and over. Trying to get the finish line, I don't care if a target got puncher, I'm taking it to the finish line. And we've got Holton Burr really, really trying, you know, like trying to get it to me. But I managed to keep a douche paint of my tar. And I finished my first yeah, ever you, podium. And I was so proud of myself, like, like but no matter how long it's been two seasons, and I finally got myself on a podium for my team and SW Black and Lisa. They've done it then. A spectacular victory here in Spain and a massive confidence boost going into the next race. Natalie Pinkham, how do you think they were able to set themselves apart today? Quite simply, a driver is nothing without the team behind them. So, a deserved winner, but we do have to give a shout out to the team in the pit lane and back at the factory. Very much a collaborative process. So after a magnificent race, we can now see the drivers making their way to the podium. Once again, it's the Silver Arrows who take the top spot. A well-earned victory for Mercedes. As you see now, we've got um, Mercedes 1, 2 and me on the podium. P3, really happy about it. It's definitely um, a bit distressed this weekend. 
but intolerable um, practice touching I had, neither had the technician with the wall, but that mixed up with the um, um, attire placement on the bars, and then in the final went on and tried the vacuum tape professional pole and keep it in two D, but unfortunately, uh, I think it was George that taken it. But overall, I finished P three from P seven up to P three. It's a bit. It's one of the really good races there. And Dor and Mikla and Dor a tie now. So I'm with Tom. Mikla, if he finishes third, he'll be tied with point with Dor Marshall. So how top can I be doing this day? Some proper competition with this win. But we stayed at Liver. We still don't know who the third li uh, number one Liver in the we stayed in. It's a bit child, it's been your. But in reality, it's both of them because they have completed for the championship. So it's a bit one, and we got uh, obviously we you know, deal. Ultimately, we got the end up due to, uh, I think, some titles of Fainer. Yeah, it's the titles of Fainer. We got Orlando. Obviously, they end up at, well. I think it's all shot Metallic of Vayner he's got, but he has an issue. So I assume he had the Metallic of Vayner, but I just see the rival breakdown. Maybe better than Lando, but obviously Lando didn't win it because he got more points uh, than me. Um, but I mean, overall, I'm very proud of this long point. Probably one of the best by far, with exciting fighting and defending with um, Sergio Pala. Um, didn't even think I was challenging what ball at all. I didn't even think. So, we're going to end it here. I'm going to see you in Talada. So, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, turn the notification bell on, and peace out.